JCB they make backhoe diggers, which is what's commonly known as a JCB. We build them and test them and sell them to customers for construction. My name's Sam Grief, I'm a level three apprentice at JCB, and I'm doing mechanics in research and development of power systems. Currently in Staffordshire at the JCB Academy, which is where the apprentices do a lot of the theory side. And we're also in the same area where the factory is just down the road. I first came here when I was 14 years old. I did my GCSEs for two years here, got my qualifications, and straight away, the last year of education, I applied for an apprenticeship at JCB. Because I liked it here so much, I thought it will be good to work for the company as well, because I want to do something that I enjoy. I always had a misconception that it's a dirty job, you don't get paid much, and the education is low, but I'd say I do the same level as people doing A-levels are doing. I come out with similar qualifications. I get paid when they're not getting paid, and I get a lot of experience in the workplace as well. My short-term plan is just to finish my apprenticeship first, and then once that's done, I'd want to be a technician in research and development. How they look after you, the places that we go to, the opportunities to give you, it's, it's second to none. They give me opportunities to do the engine builds, they give me the opportunity to do the electronics behind a lot of the stuff, and they give me you know, a lot of opportunities to do different things within that department. The satisfaction I get from being able to find how to fix it or why it's doing it, it's being able to work something out and feeling good about yourself that you can do it, that's definitely the highlight of my day. Definitely research into different things you can do. Don't set your mind on sixth form, don't set your mind on apprenticeships, always keep an open mind.